Hello world. I am Imagination. In this video, I am going to talk about Starlink. Starlink is a satellite constellation being constructed by SpaceX to provide satellite internet access. The constellation will consist of thousands of mass-produced small satellites in low Earth orbit, LEO, working in combination with ground transceivers. SpaceX also plans to sell some of the satellites for military, scientific, or exploratory purposes. The SpaceX Satellite Development Facility in Redmond, Washington houses the Starlink research, development, manufacturing, and on-orbit control operations. The total cost of the decade-long project to design, build, and deploy the constellation was estimated by SpaceX in May 2018 to be about 10 billion US dollars. Product development began in 2015, with the first two prototype test flight satellites launched in February 2018. The second set of test satellites and the first large deployment of a piece of the constellation occurred in May 2019 when the first 60 operational satellites were launched. As of 2020, SpaceX is launching 60 satellites at a time, aiming to deploy 1,584 of the 260 kilograms, 570 pounds, spacecraft to provide near global service by late 2021 or 2022. SpaceX is targeting a private beta service in the northern United States and Canada by August 2020 with a public beta following in November 2020. Service beginning at high latitudes between 44 degrees minus 52 degrees north. Concerns have been raised about the long-term danger of space debris resulting from placing thousands of satellites in orbits above 600 kilometers, as well as the negative impact on observational and radio astronomy on Earth. In response, SpaceX has lowered the Starlink satellite orbits to 550 kilometers or below and launched prototype satellites with anti-reflective coating and an experimental sunshade. On October 15, 2019, the U.S. Federal Communications Commission submitted filings to the International Telecommunication Union on SpaceX's behalf to arrange a spectrum for 30,000 additional Starlink satellites to supplement the 12,000 Starlink satellites already approved by the FCC. As of August 2020, SpaceX has launched 597 Starlink satellites. They plan to launch 60 more per Falcon 9 flight, with launches as often as every two weeks in 2020. In total, nearly 12,000 satellites are planned to be deployed, with a possible later extension to 42,000. The initial 12,000 satellites are planned to orbit in three orbital shells. SpaceX intends to provide satellite internet connectivity to underserved areas of the planet, as well as provide competitively priced service to urban areas. The company has stated that the positive cash flow from selling satellite internet services would be necessary to fund their Mars plans. SpaceX has long-term plans to develop and deploy a version of the satellite communication system to serve Mars. The system will not directly connect from its satellites to handsets. Instead, it will be linked to flat user terminals the size of a pizza box, which will have phased array antennas and track the satellites. The terminals can be mounted anywhere, as long as they can see the sky. Photographs of the customer antennas began to be seen on the Internet in June 2020, supporting earlier statements by SpaceX CEO Musk that the terminals would look like a UFO on a stick. Starlink terminal has motors to self-adjust optimal angle to view sky. The world currently has a population of nearly 7.8 billion people. A little under half of them do not have regular internet access. As Starlink comes online and makes access possible for nearly 4 billion people, we can expect the fundamental makeup of the internet to change. That includes the language and cultural norms of digital communities. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.